Hey everyone. Uh, sorry, I had to push the stream and back a little bit late. Ooh, we can all drop. Nom, 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 nom. Yes, I had to push the streamer back a little bit because I had to uh, do a couple of things. But um, yeah, <laughs> made it in. Uh, I was going to mention, I was meant to mention something before I started drawing. Uh, I can't quite remember. I'm sure I'll remember some time during the stream. I'll have to, <laughs> if I remember it, I'll, uh, I'll mention it. Um, but just a small little thing. Uh, tomorrow we are doing a collaboration with a couple of other people where we're playing the forest and I guess it's just the forest, really. Uh, I will be putting like a little command so you can check out the other um, individuals streams as well. Um, not, I, I don't really, ooh, sorry, the, uh, I'm just noticing the internet's on the fritz, but hopefully it'll be all right. I'm noticing that the, uh, I'm just sorry. I'm not usually uh, good at the game or good at any of the said games that I play. So uh, don't expect too much from it. Uh, I just noticed as well there's no music. But yes. Anyways, let's, uh, let's go do some drawings. Um, I kind of want to do a colorful piece. Just sort of like imagine like um like bubble gum. <laughs> I don't know what you would call it, bubble gum. The only thing that comes to mind with the art piece I have in mind is just bubble gum. Just the imagine bubble gum. And you think the word bubble gum? Alright. Bubblegum art. I wonder if that's an actual thing you can like search up. Alright, let me just get my canvas down. Canvas, we'll just do 72. There. I'm going to have a quick look what if bubblegum art is a thing. Bubblegum art style. Bubblegum art style. I mean, it's just a bunch of portraits of them blowing bubblegum. So, I guess, technically, it's a thing. Not, don't quite get it, but um, it exists. All right. So, let's try. Uh, so, another thing I want to try and do during the stream, I want to try and, I need like a timer or something. I'll see if I can grab a timer. Timer. I think uh, Google has a timer because I want to try and time myself to see how long I, um, it takes me for me to draw at least something decent just so I can sort of measure and gauge. Cause, um, when I draw and stream, I should usually flounder around. So I don't exactly know how long the actual piece starts for, like how, when I start drawing a piece, I don't actually know how long it takes. Because, uh, you know, I'm just sort of noodling about like this, like what I'm doing right now. So I just need one at a timer to time the actual drawing. I also need to see if I can, like, get a little timer placed down, I don't know, up here or down here, maybe. Somewhere around on the screen. It'd be nice. Uh, hmm. All right, let's start with the warm-ups real quick. Hey, thanks. Welcome, welcome. Yes. I am a gelatinous cube. A very slimy little gelatinous cube. So what are you making today? Um I was hoping to make a complete like complete a, an art an art within a certain amount of time. 
as for the actual art itself, I'm not entirely sure. I know I want to make a, like a, I don't know, maybe like a, a, a female standing in maybe a street or something or a, like a, in some sort of scene or maybe in a field. I'm not entirely sure yet. So I'm just going to sort of splash, splash, feel it out. Oh, and thanks for, hey, you'd be the 100th follower, I believe. Congrats. Yeah. Right now, um, we were, you pretty much caught the very beginning of the stream. I just need to do some spirals, just warm up my, um, warm up before I start doing drawings. Just a you like a star of the stream ritual for myself. <laughs> yeah. How'd you um how'd you discover this part of the caves? Oh. I am well. Why uh are you did you change your um account name? Yeah, you know, some lines are straight. <clears throat> some are straight lines. Yeah, I usually just do um spirals. Spirals are usually my um my warm ups. I'm always jumping every stream to find some place to stay. Oh, I see. Yeah, I think I might try going the other way. Actually. Boop, 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 boop. But yes, I'm fine, um, Sam. <laughs> I'm fine. How's the music? Is it too soft or too loud? All right, I think I'm pretty much warmed up. Okay. Maybe I'll change this to a, uh, it's perfect. Okay, that's good. Don't want this portrait. No, we'll keep it. We'll keep it, uh. We'll keep it, uh, portrait. All right. Back. Sorry, I got disconnected from my the internet. Ah. And so why the different account name, if you don't mind me asking? Okay, let's just get, let's just sort of feel out a character right now. Maybe we'll have it walk, we'll have her walking in a street or something. I don't know. Change your name? Fair enough. At hand. Ah, yes, it's my little pseudopodia, my pseudopod to hold my magic crayon. <laughs> it's magic because it can change into various shapes. Wow. Maybe we'll have like, have a walking. My friend have food names. Oh, I see. We could probably make this a little bit fantastical for the funs of it. So maybe like she's walking and then there's just like a, like a thing. Just a really weird thing walking with her. Oh, I see you start with gestures. I can sense professionalism. I am, I am, a, I am far from professional. <laughs> I am far from it. So yeah, kind of just might be like, this is like a, a random neighborhood. Like we'll have, um, we'll have like, like fences here, houses. Uh, I don't know, a gate here. And we just had like a weird creature. Just sort of. I don't know. It's like there. Blech. Is it a snake? <laughs> Thanks for the hydrate. That's what they all say.
and gremlins. I believe they're messing with the cables. It's not the actual truth, but um, I would love to believe it is. We just got bad internet. It's in the cave. <laughs> okay. But yeah. So I um I don't actually want it to be a snake. I want to make it like a fantasy. Like a, I don't know. Just a creature. I don't want it to be actually a. Uh, your cover, your cover is so cute. My cover? What, which, what, co which cover? Oh, you mean the, the background, the layout thing? Is that what you mean? In your profile? Oh! <laughs> Oh, I see. I see. I see. I catch you. <laughs> oh, you the um. Uh, let me just grab it. You talking about this? Wow, the internet's just jumping all over the place today, huh? Um, yeah. This one took me a moment because I haven't actually. <laughs> I haven't been to this picture in a while. I completely forgot. That's not the one. Get out of here. Oh my goodness. Where is it? Twitch. Offering. There it is. Little sleepy slime. This is not uh, the music I was after. It's dope and all, but it's not what I wanted. I don't know what this is. I forgot. Uh, yes, yes. I think that was one of the first images I drew for uh, for my channel. Uh, let me just quickly change the. Uh, the radio station. I want some more chip tuny vibes. Or is this already chip tunes? All right. Um, bup, 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 bup. There we go. Now we just need to hit next. Sweet. Uh, I knew you had it. <laughs> I'm, I'm only a hobbyist. I'm only a hobbyist. I, I wish I was professional. I've seen um, professionals, arts, and how they do things, and I, I don't believe I'm anywhere near that level. But, <laughs> but thank you. It means a lot. Okay, so we'll have a walking there. Maybe we'll have like a cat as well, sort of over here. Yes, yes. <laughs> I mean it. I'm, I'm serious. We have the cat over here, looking up, so I don't have to worry too much about drawing its face. That's a big cat. That's a long cat. So we'll have her looking at the cat. The cat's going to look at that, and that's going to look at that. So I kind of have like a little triangle relationship we're going on. A love triangle. It's kind of, this cat's massive. Hold up. Why is it so big? It's a really good time to say that I don't know how to draw cats. Interesting, though. Hey there! Oh, the badge is so tiny. Little tiny cube. Little budling. Did is did the uh hold on, did the other uh yeah you got gifted a sub. I think that might have been from half or half, however you wanna pronounce it. Hold up. Is the other emoji working? Oops.
Oh my goodness, where is it? Oh, there it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I made that one. Um, <laughs> we're gonna fly around the screen. Uh, I th yeah, I think I made that one about. I think yesterday. I only have two slots at the moment. I'll be able to have three soon, hopefully. So we can add some more little fun things. I also added a command where if you type exclamation point drop followed by an emoji, um, it'll do something. Well, man, I imagine you started and someone, I mean, <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I mean, if someone like saves up for a long time and that, I, I wouldn't be mad. I'd be just amazed. I'll be very amazed. Who knows? There you go. Look at that. And basically, the uh, you just try to land in the pool. I believe um, it refreshes every six minutes. Yeah, see, I like this little fun thing to do. Um, I don't know, little fun thing to do. It was shown to me by uh, by um, Wick. Yeah, you can. It only um, it only after like the game resets, you can do it again. Let's see, bud. And I think if you don't put anything on it, it just drops a random <laughs> avatar. I don't know what that is. Little zombie. <laughs> I just need to redo this cat. I think cats are about. This is a big cat. This. Oh my goodness me, cats. Hey, Caribro. <laughs> oh my goodness so i was watching um i was watching a, an anime i guess an anime movie last night on on the netflix called um what was it it had a really catchy name it was words words bubble up like soda pop i think that's what it was called let me have a look Words bubble up like soda pop. Yeah. It was a very, uh, it's very cute. <laughs> it's a very cute anime. It is like, it is a bit, it is somewhat cliched, but it is, um, it's nice. <laughs> it's... And I was just sort of looking at, watch, looking at, and looking at the art style and the animation style reminded me of something that I couldn't quite get my, like, it was on like the animation style reminded me of something, but couldn't. It was on the tip of my tongue. Have to make sure to thank Half and Lion next time they're here. Yeah, Half a, Half pops their head in every now and then, from time to time. Yeah, so I'm gonna have a cat here. This woman's gonna notice this cat. The cat's gonna notice this creature. Maybe we'll just have it like. We'll have it goofy, I guess. I don't exactly know what I want to do with this. Maybe, maybe it's like a, like a lung dragon, like those um. Chinese or Asian dragons, wyverns, like this, I guess. All right, may I ask if you're okay using your PC to draw? <laughs> okay, when I use your drawing from Gudra and Gumi as my yeah, no, no, go for it. If you want to use it, come go for it. There's a background. I don't mind.
Make a gecko type monster and attach to the wall above them. Make it a gecko type monster and attach to the wall above. Uh hmm. What does a gecko look like? I guess it's like a lizard. Are we gonna show me the gecko lizard? Gecko. Hmm, we could. We'll fiddle around. We'll fiddle around. We're in the early conception idea, right? Early conception stage right now. So. Hold up. Let's erase this around here. Because I do want this to be like a somewhat neighborhood or suburban area. So I do want like... If you ever watch those animes or just like I don't know, I guess it's just not restricted just to anime. I guess it's in in most places. But usually, when you see those like fences in in these medias, they usually have like a wall instead of like a picket fence, just a straight up wall. I kind of want to have like a wall there, and um have like potted plants here and there, just to add some variety of color into the piece. Of course, this creature could just be flat out color galore. It is going to be like a fantasy creature. Or a fantastical creature is a better word. I also want to try and incorporate perspective things. Also, I need to turn on my uh, stopwatch. Or the timer. So I know how long it takes me to draw. Start. Oh, and I need to turn on time lapse on on this drawing so we can and at the end we get to see it uh we can see it animated or rather we can see the process of it being made which i think would be fun a little treat at the end of the uh stream uh wiggly just needs to remember where the time lapse function is animation oh there it is as on the files record time lapse uh, yes. Neat sketch. Yes. Thank you. It's a bit messy right now, but we're just trying to key out. <laughs> just need to try and key out what we want the, uh, or rather feel out what we want the, um, the picture to look like. I also need to get like a bit of a, <laughs> I've, I haven't drawn many cats. I probably need to grab some reference of what a cat looks like. All right. So where's our vanishing point? We're looking down this way. People say fundamental is just a waste of time, but it's a very useful thing. Yes, absolutely. Um. A good way to view fundamentals is literally they're they're tools. They're just like they're just tools. So if you need to uh sure you can like you know, you can skip the fundamentals and just go straight to drawing. It's essentially like getting a um a how to like one of those flat packs where it's um you just pretty much assemble it yourself. Whereas if you know the fundamentals that's like having the um the hacksaw or the saw, the drills, the um the the ev the the everything to craft your own furniture. Yeah. So the vanishing point's like all the way over here. Hold up. 
can just go like there. Over here. And let's just put the other one over there. So that. Just do two. We'll just do two point perspective. <laughs> Doing more than two points is a little, little, little bit too much what too bit too much what I want to do. I just want to sort of relax today. <laughs> And just put up a circle marker. So it's kind of like this. So yes, I hope um everyone everyone's day, night. I think it might be night. No, it might be day, morning right now, I guess, is going well thus far. Uh currently on in the caves at least. Um <laughs> The joy has spread a little bit too much, and everyone has to be, uh, everyone's sort of in their own corner of the caves right now for at least seven days, <laughs> because there's just way too much happiness being spread inside the caves right now. Way too much happiness. Everyone needs to just, like, you know, need to settle down. <laughs> So I might be able to stream uh, probably a couple more times or even at different different times this this coming week. I don't know. We'll feel it out. <laughs> yeah. Feeling good with that. So we've got the monster there. I might need to fix make this i'll define the house a little bit better i'll just <laughs> what do houses look like i'll just go for like a house <laughs> okay that's what houses look like i see Yeah, I guess that's fine. Um, maybe we just do like a schoolgirl. Why not? Right? We'll just do like a a lass going to school, and she notices the cat, and then there's a thing behind her that she doesn't see. Okay. I just noticed how big this cat is. I think I might need to make the cat a little bit smaller. <laughs> Even when I tried to downscale this cat, it's still too big. So. I think I made that leg a little bit too exaggerated with its step. Okay. Uh, 
Just like this, that, that. I need to do some more feet drawings or foot in, feet in general. I'll fix it up later. Just want to make sure we get all this down. All right, how do we want, do we want her to hold the bag? I do need to pose myself. Yeah, why not? We'll have her holding onto the bag, like, over her shoulder, just to give her a little bit better, an interesting pose, I guess. So, hand up here. Like this, I guess. Yeah. Hold on, maybe I'll have her other hand doing it instead, just so we have that balance. That's not the marker. Alrighty. Yes. It's gonna go ahead. I cannot. Uh, this is. <laughs> um. <laughs> I cannot sketch clean like that. Yeah, I mean, in my, I guess I don't know. In my eyes, this is like uber mess, like super messy. But again, thanks. I get. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how to, I'm not very good at taking, taking words. <laughs> All right. Being there, my eyes are messy. I see. Well, I mean, it's a sketch. No one really has to read it. It's so long as you understand what's, what it is, uh, it's, it's all good. <laughs> Just have it like a normal, a normal hair, sort of shoulder length. I don't even know it's a sketch. Yeah, the one thing I do like about sketches is just even if it's messy, they the messiness adds to it. You know. <laughs> The one thing I like about sketches, I can't do line art. Line art, I can't do. I just skip line art and just go straight to coloring. <laughs> because line art, for those who are return, like those who know me, um, I don't do line art because <laughs> it. I, I'm I'm doing my best to learn it. Like I'm not trying to avoid it. I am trying to learn it. I'm just not good. Good with it. <laughs> I just cover it well. And... Yeah. Same. If I do have line art, I, I cover it. I hide it. I'm shameful. I'm shamed of my line art. <laughs> it's just a shame that the uh, background is hard. Yeah. I do like backgrounds. Um, backgrounds are hard, I guess, but they are kind of fun in my opinion. I do enjoy drawing them more than I do draw, like, like characters, I guess. Just with backgrounds, you have like a little bit more, at least I'm, you know, you can play with it a little bit. You can still play with characters, but um, I know. Just drawing like nature-y stuff is, I find it fun. Just zoom enhance on face. <laughs> Just put 
these here for now, just so we can show where the eyes are. It's fine. And I think there's going to be like something in here. Bodies here. Okay, let me have a look. Zoom out. All right. Uh, I'm just going to now touch up the cat and then we can go for a more refined sketch and I'll be able to start painting. Cat. What is cat? Cat. Enjoyable if you can do it. Yeah, I guess. Honestly, with background stuff, I sort of, I, um, I sort of picked up some of the techniques from Bob Ross. Bob Ross helps me do some backgrounds just because, uh, he, it, the way that I sort of render is almost akin to painting from what I've been told. There's some little kitty cats. All right, so these, this cut needs to be a lot smaller. Let me just grab this cat real quick. Squish that cat. Squish that cat. Maybe I'll have it like... This. And then I believe we can probably make the cat look a little bit shocked by extending its tail. Oops. Because I want this cat to be surprised. I want this cat to be a surprise cat. Boop, boop, boop. Okay, I'll move on. Wish you a great day. Bye. Okay, have a great uh, day. Interesting name here. <laughs> Hope you have a great rest of the day. Okay. So, beauty cat. Walking up this way. Tail. We'll just have it like straight. We'll have the tail straight as can be. Just for this little pass. Uh, this one's probably going to be going, this ear's probably going to go towards us. So I'll, I'll just do this for now. I know, it's supposed to be looking at the, the creature. The head needs to be turned a little bit more. <clears throat> and like this. Splat. Yeah, kind of like that. Oh my goodness. Whoop. Uh, thanks for the follow, Sailor Jupiter. Oh, hey, how you going? <laughs> Hope your day, evening, night is going well. We're currently just drawing a sketch for an image right now. Um, this is a little creature we got going, a cat and a, uh, good. Just about, uh, just finished streaming. So about to go to bed. Oh, how was the stream? Hope it went well. Actually, yeah, we could probably add in like another perspective. So we'll just do it like this. I don't know, it's gonna be too much. 
Great. We blew up. Oh. Oh. Oh, dear. Hmm. What? Uh. Huh. This is like... Were you playing that, like, a sandbox game where you sort of have the universe in the palm of your hand? Maybe I have this, like, creature with, with like, a hand or something. <laughs> it's like, shh. <laughs> what if this creature had, like, human hands? Just, shh. Don't tell. Don't let her know I'm here. Shh. Nah, lol wise, the earth blew up, and now we live in space. And yes, the human hands. <laughs> All right. Anyways, have a good day, night. Okay, you too. Have a good rest. Have a good sleep. Yes, you're going to bed. Have a good sleep. And thanks again for the follow. Welcome to the adventure. All right. So we have this. The girl is going to look at the cat. The cat is looking at the monster. I think this monster needs more eyes. <clears throat> adventure sounds fun. Yes, anyone who follows is part of the adventure. <clears throat> Excuse me. Is that a dragon? Um, I believe this is going to be like a cross between of many things because I do want this thing to have like, yeah, like a, it kind of has like a long dragon vibe to it. But I just want to add, like, weird features to it. So what I'm planning on doing is having, um, like, legs, like, multiple legs with, like, a, with a, either hands, feet, or appendages at the, at the end of them. I just want this to be a strange creature. So, yeah, we have, like, legs. More fictional. Yeah. I don't know, having, adding too many eyes makes it seem more aggressive or more, hmm, I'll tell you what, we'll just, we'll just keep the, yeah, I do intend this to be more like colorful, <clears throat> my goodness. Yeah, I don't think I want the hand up at the face. I think I'll just keep the um the dragon's focus on the girl rather than the it looking at the cat. Yeah, I might try and I think I might make these eyes a little bit bigger. Like kind of bug bug eyed sort of. Kind of bug eyed. Are those like spirit creatures. Yeah, kind of, I guess. Yeah, we'll, we'll we'll work that way. Work it like that way. Kind of um like the cat can see it, but the the young lass can't. So she's just looking at confused the cat why it's why it's being all startled because this cat's gonna be like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you can't see it. My little jar's in the way. Yeah, just sort of startled cat down here. Yeah, well, we can definitely add some more little creatures around the place, but I just want these main subject, the main focus of the piece, um, worked in properly first. <clears throat> Hmm. 
the extra creatures we can definitely work in. Um, yeah, I do plan the cat to be startled. And the girl's going to look confused towards the cat. Because right now we've got the relationship between the girl and the cat, the cat and the, the creature, and the creature and the girl. At least that's the intention. Add weird birds. Yeah. I don't want to go too overboard with it. I want this place to still seem like somewhat mm, mundane. And this thing is just sort of with the girl. But yeah. Right. Kind of going. I will add some pod plants like here. Guys, this person likes potted plants. Uh, the fence going like this way. Going. This. And actually, no, it should be like this. Right? Hold up. This? Yes, like this. By the way, if you ever talk to me and I don't reply, that means I'm roaming around streams. Ah, no worries. No worries. Something like this. That, and we'll just have like another. Oh, these perspectives are nonsensical. It's all right. <laughs> Let's have it like that. And this thing's uh will have it not cast a shadow. This thing does not have a shadow. Okay, over there. Okay. What is this? This is not chiptunes. Please. All right. Um, I think maybe like a pole or something. Yeah, I'm feeling a pole. We'll add like a little, like a sign. I like a sign here or something. And it's like those signs you would see that would have like, um, place trash here or something like that. And we'll just have little boxes. Little boxes are uh, in here as well. This is a very yeah, fix up his face a little bit. Uh, boxes and trash alike just littered this area. Let me just put trash bags or something. Let me have a look at some, uh, some garbage bags. Look 
garbage disposal. Okay. Excellent. All right. So we'll just have like little. Piles, I guess, like this. Little boxes. Yeah, this is, has a bit of a wonky perspective. I might have to like roof. Like fix it later on down the line. It's all right. I think I'll put like a pole here. This can be like the the other wall. We're sort of like peeking over it. Yeah, I think this will be all right. Let's have a zoom out real quick. I wonder if I can actually add perspective lines into this. It'd be really nice if I could. Um, hmm. Welcome back. I guess I can add perspective lines. Is that a thing? Perspective rule line? Is that an actual? All right. Let's try this out. Vanishing point over there. Uh, vanishing point. Where is this one going to be? Over there. Hmm? Uh, are you going to finish it? Everything? Uh, if you mean finish the picture, yeah. We're going to be um, finishing it. Yes, we're going to be finishing it. There's one there. There. Uh, guess like this. Goodness me. That'd be a fun bench. Yeah. Definitely would be. Will be. Okay. So I guess how this wants to work all right we'll do, we'll just zoom out we'll just get these perspective lines down this isn't you know what <laughs> 
I have to f I have to fiddle around with this because I don't understand how this tool wants to be used. So adds a vanishing point. Oh, I think I'm slowly getting it. Okay. It's all right. I got it now. <laughs> all right. So we'll add another vanishing point. All right. Over there. Oh God. Ugh. Perspective can really sense professionalism. <laughs> I'm just trying to learn them better. That's all I'm doing. Nothing professional right now. Just trying to learn them a bit better. I want to be able to start doing like doing all this stuff without having to um without having to rely on drawing lines so i can just sort of visualize it in the mind so nothing professional just just learning oops uh, let me just go at guide I think that's, can I make this, no, I can't, all right, I think that's, I think the perspective's all pretty, it's all, almost all decently done, actually, almost, <laughs> that's fine, we will fix up some of the stuff we can see, though. Um, it would make it that would make it fast if you're able to learn that. Yeah, drawing your ratio. Cool, cool. How do I erase this? Like, fix up this box. We can always turn that on when we need to. Yeah, so this box over here just needs to be fixed. Okay. Yeah. All right, I think we can start refining this a little bit more now. We've got our scene. Let's just fix up our subjects. Need to reduce my marker. I'll we'll focus on the girl for now. Yep. Okay. Okay. And 
Oh wait, she's supposed to be looking a little bit confused with the cat. So let's just fix up this expression a little bit more. Maybe we'll just get this in actually. <laughs> Boop, 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 boop. I'm going to use my circle marker for this one, actually. Yeah, there we are. Okay. Um Okay. Get this hand. Um, no, this is not line art. Um, this is just me trying to refine the sketch a little bit more. Just so I can, so when I start coloring or start painting, I just know the features, yeah. Honestly, I can probably just start coloring now. I, mean, I have enough information on like this thing. I can definitely add in like stuff later. I just wanted to make sure this um female, the, the girl here, I just want to make sure I have a little bit more detail in it because um when it comes to humanoids, I struggle a little bit um struggle a little bit when shaping them. How to paint? Um how to paint? Do you mean like how do I paint? Oh, so um the way I paint is I guess the uh, a, a way to say it is I block I block them, I block in colors. And then I um shape them kind of like clay. I, uh, I, you'll be able to see soon. I'm just doing really the girl here right now. I'm just really detailing her. But yeah, I just block in the, um, the colors, then I sculpt them um, into the shapes I need them to be. Similar to how, I guess, a painter, like, literally, that's what I mentioned before. The way I like to color is almost like a painter's. Almost. Uh, it's not quite like a painter, but it's close to it. Do you do commissions? Um... Yes, I've opened up recently for commissions. Um, as for pricing, uh, I'm. It depends on what you would like done. Really, I haven't got a sheet just yet, just because I really opened up to the public with commissions. The only other commissions I've really done is for like um, close circle, <clears throat> close circle friends from real life. Nothing on the internet. <clears throat> Excuse me. But yes. I'm currently, currently trying to create a sheet as well as like a portfolio. Stars with Garth. 
Thanks. I'm glad you are. Uh, I'm glad you think that. I have a quick gander of some feet, because I want to make sure I get these feet. Okay, so it's still somewhat... This be somewhat flat still. We'll just put in blocks for now and I'll fix it up as we paint. I'm all glad I found the stream. I'm glad you uh, stumbled upon it. Glad you stumbled upon it. It's always nice to chat to new people and newcomers. This foot's like way. I think that's fine, actually. I also need to look up like a reference for some school uniforms. Not, I don't really want to do like one of those middle school Japanese uniforms with the, the sailor thing on the back. I just want like a normal, like a blouse. I don't know what you call this, a jumper, a blouse, a sweater. Can you do any realistic style anime? Uh, can you do any? So, uh, two days ago, I don't know if you would call this realistic. I guess this is more cartoony. I'll show it here on stream. Let me just load it up. Uh, realistic, not quite. Oh, here we I'll open up a couple. So we got the Gudra. Uh, let's get Bree. And yeah, there we go. I'll open up a couple. You probably see the, the painter-ish style that I have in a couple of these, I guess. Style is one of the things I can't really um comprehend because it's kind of like an accent, right? An artist's style is like an accent. You can't, you don't really notice what it is unless someone points it out to you. Or points out that you have a style. So I honestly don't know what mine is. Okay. So, oh, there we go. So this is the one we did, um, two, what's going on? Stop this. Stop. Yeah, it's like a I, Clip Studio is just saving right now for some reason. And the internet is going on the fritz. Yep, so we, there's this one that we did two days ago. Um, ignore the faces. We uh we decided to have some fun with the faces, but overall this is what uh what we did. <laughs> um this one is what we did I think uh uh, maybe two days prior to the previous one. More Pokemons, just having fun painting with this one. And this one is of a, another V artist or an artist where I just sort of paint their avatar using a very, trying to be very painterly about it. I can't really do realism as much as I'd love to. I really can't. Not yet anyways. Because um, I would absolutely love, 
I can only do anime. I I can't do anime. Anime is the one thing I can't do well. I'll give an example of what my attempt of anime is. Anime. Anime, 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 anime. Um, magical girl cat in cave. I don't remember what this one is. Let me just zoom out just in case it's something. Uh, oh, yes, I guess. Oh, yeah, here it is. There's my anime. Found it. This is my attempt of anime. Honestly, I don't think it's. I don't think I'm, I'm, I'm there yet. This I'm someone was working on this piece. This is supposed to be like a '50s style poster. This is my attempt at being at, at being anime. Yeah. Yeah. I actually need to finish this actually. I'll have to finish most of this one soon, or attempt to. Yeah, I, I'm... I mean, I, I'm not really happy with the, the drawing itself, but um, yeah, I, I want to improve in the anime genre. It'd be nice. A lot of people seem to like their avatars being drawn animated, in anime style or in the anime aesthetic. Definitely work, try, definitely trying to improve uh, my art skills. I'll absorb a bunch of people's arts. I especially want to try and learn to do some line arts, because, oh my goodness me. Line art can be very nice. I envy those who can do a line art. I'm at the strap or something over here. I think I need a... How does one hold... I guess the elbow's up a little bit higher. A little bit higher. Yeah, like this. As for the eyes, we need to make sure where her face is to begin with. Alright, where's the cat? Cat's down there. She's going to be somewhat straight on. There. Kind of like this. Mine's gonna be like there, I guess. Just draw in the eyes, just simple little place where the eyes are gonna be placed. Ooh, this is. Oh, I thought this was gonna be a waltz, but it's not. Boom, bum, bum, boom, bum, bum, boom, bum, bum. I'm gonna try and sculpt her face a little bit more. I don't have to worry too much about her face. I'll fix her face after. Oh, she got a large forehead. That's fine. We'll fix it when we color. Just want to make sure we have a bit of a more defined character before we start painting. I think that's pretty much. Don't worry too much about our hand right now. 
I'll just put something here, like a, a school badge or something, school logo. That girl's cute. Yeah, we'll, we'll try to make her cuter. <laughs> we'll try to make her as cute as possible. Alright, I just need to have a quick Google of some Japanese uniforms. That is not sailor uniforms. How about like... Yeah, we'll just go with that one. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right, so. Did I press a button? They got wife material. <laughs> Let no, I don't think we're gonna be doing that. <laughs> what did I? Oh my goodness! PC. Oh. Are you ready for the wiggle? Huh? I see. All right. Oh, I need to zoom in for this. Where's my... There it is. Oh, wait, am I too big? <laughs> Oh, what happened? Everything's... Yeah? <laughs> yeah, um... After my re-debut, I'm definitely gonna get, like, a gamer... I'm gonna definitely gonna get like a gamer, uh, a gamer slime redeem where I just go all RGB. Yeah, after the redebut. I'm currently working on an updated model right now. All right. <laughs> Very worth it, must say. <laughs> Pat my avatar. Oh wait, I think that's a thing. Just, for, just for this. There you go. Oh, yes, the legendary hand. Yes. All right. I think. I think that's pretty much all the information I need for now. We can probably get started. All right, let's get started. Can we just put these? Um, I'm actually currently working on my, on my Discord right now. So not quite, um, I'm not quite, I don't have a Discord at the moment. You're talking about like a, like a Discord server. Yeah. 
There should oh my goodness, where's my things? We should be having a Discord at the end around the end of this week. Uh I wanna get a critique from you. Oh, I see. Um Yeah, okay. Uh when the Discord gets thrown up, you can definitely um you know, throw it up there. Yeah, currently at the moment, no no Discord at this current time. All right, so houses, I think for the houses, we'll just, actually, we'll do the road. We'll start with the road. You have a Twitter? Yeah, I have a Twitter. It is Nightbot. Would you like to show them Twitter? There you go. My Twitter is over there. Um, I think Ashfelt will have Ashfelt be slightly orange. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay, let's just do this. Um, as for the actual walls, the walls will just have a gray. Actually, no. What kind of colors do the Japanese places have their walls? I'm just typing Japanese street or something. Japanese rural street or something. Japanese street. Yeah, they're like pretty gray. I'm pretty gray. There's a couple of reds. We'll have a we'll have it like a slightly red, like a a ready, a washed out sort of red. Yeah. Safe canvas? Alright, thanks for the save. I completely forgot to. Delicious. Delicious fluids. Uh, what do we call this one? We'll call it, um... Uh, girl walks through street <laughs> with spirit. Go with spirit. How about that? Go with spirit. In street. <laughs> I am very good at naming things. Okay, well saved. Maybe, maybe. Oh, sorry. Uh, I my my kind of got lost in the text. White and red. Is is it a traditional? Depends, man. It's Oh, uh, if you're talking about the houses, uh, it's, I was just thinking about more um, just like the urban housing. Just like whenever you see like, um, like uh, anime school life, whenever they walk down in the street, they'll have like uh, this sort of setup. It's a very narrow street, I must say. So I want a washed out red here. I want a brown. Talk to DR. Wizard and he says the skull in your head. Blech. Says that the skull in your head is hard to remove while moving effect. Cool.
Oops, same with brown. Yeah. Actually, I actually don't have to worry too much about the stuff underneath here. I just need to worry about the stuff over here. Oh, Dr. Wizard. Uh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, yep, I see. <laughs> okay, I get it now. I get it. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> As for this one here, I'll have it like a different color. I'll just have it like gray. Just have this one being gray. As for the house, let me have a quick gander again at my little reference piece. Um. We'll have it like a cream color, I guess. Let's do a cream. Keep it all sort of in this sort of grayish thing. We don't want it to pull too much attention. Oh my. There we go. Oop, that's not the color I was after. Yeah. So do red slime, so red slimes are evil or are they just angry all the time? I think they just have a bit of a temper tantrum. I think red slimes just have a temper tantrum. I think that's their, they just have a, they just need to learn how to manage their anger better. Oh, I just realized I should. That's right, I'll paint it in now. All right, easy fix. Do that. It's a little bit darker than that. No, actually a little bit lighter than that. A little bit lighter. There we go. Uh, that wall over there, we'll just sort of keep it like this. I want this color. And this house over here, uh, we'll make it more yellow. Yes. Oops. Not you more yet. Yeah. A little slightly more yellow. And then as we do the uh the highlights and the shadows, we'll make it a bit better. Uh, there is a pole here, or rather a wooden pole, so I'll add this over here. Excellent. This cardboard box over here. We'll just use the same colors as the wood and we'll just place it here. Just so we're not, just to like, you know, keep it all in one, one palette, I guess. Uh, we got a pole there. We'll just use 
just like this color, I guess. I think it needs to be a little bit darker. Lost connection. Uh, yeah. Sorry about that. It's the, the, there's like ceiling gremlins right now. I can see that my internet's kind of jumping up and down. So yeah, if you lose connection, <laughs> sorry, the cave internet, the cave, the cave internet's just not the greatest down here. Yeah. We kind of got shafted in the uh, hole. The tech, yeah. I see like surface world internet and I'm just like, I go bug eyed seeing like the speeds that they have up there. yeah if it's if it's like if it's glitching it's m most likely the internet because i'm not losing any frames from my pc um from my pc it's just the network um yeah, tonight just seems to be a bad night. Usually it's fine. Uh, I guess something must be happening. Yeah. I hope that as the night progresses, it gets better because honestly, I, you know, it's not a pleasant experience for any viewer to constantly have like, these issues but it's <laughs> yeah i just wish uh just wish the caves would provide only recently we had access to our uh, broadband i think no fiber fiber Cable? Optics? Fiber optics? I think that's only a very recent thing we just got. Oh my god, please. I'm like lost 2%. Yeah. Um. Hopefully it's stable now. It's on the green right now. Hopefully it's stable. I am herping. Yeah, tonight just seems to be a really funky night. With the other streams, it was decent. It worked well. It just seems to be something... Something's amiss. One should be like this kind Okay. All right, let me just zoom out. Turn off the sketch real quick. All right. Sweet. BRB, watch some YouTube TV, then leave some. No worries. Oh. <laughs> You look at my okay, no worries. <laughs> yeah, my YouTube has edited content on there.
Um, I hope it provides some form of entertainment. That's why I like. Uh, that's why I made the videos to entertain others. <laughs> but yes, I hope it. For, I hope it provides some form of entertainment for you. Especially during these, uh, these weird times. When's the sun coming down? Maybe we'll have the sun coming down. We had it coming down this way. All right, yeah, maybe we'll have it that way. If I had the sun coming. Okay, so. Okay, so the sun's gonna come down here. It's gonna come down this way. Shadow's gonna be made. Okay, there's a shadow there. All right, let's fix this up. My goodness me. Shadow comes down this way. Yeah, 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 there'll still be a shadow because of that, um, that building. But probably it's going to be like this. I'm assuming you've seen the Stardew Valley one. I'm just going to move this hair, this head pad over here for now. Yeah, I'm assuming you watched the Stardew Valley one then. The one where I was collabing with Mirpi and Swift. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Totally legit. I am the, v the VA. <laughs> But, uh, just, just for, like, transparency, no, I wish. I wish I was a VA. For, I, I wish I was a VA in general. I think it'd be fun to give life to characters through a voice. That's what the, all right, we'll start doing some of the, we'll block in some of these characters. Yes, I hope to. I honestly find it very fun just making videos. It is a bit time consuming, but um, you know, it's fun. I guess it's just similar to how uh, one does drawings, I guess. 
time consuming, but if you take the time, you'll make something cool. Okay, remember, Wiggly, you don't have to really construct yourself to these lines. You just need to make sure you get close to them and sort of feel it out as you go. But yes, thank you. Thank you for your words. They mean a lot. Yes. So the way I like to do, at least the way I've sort of had to force myself to now, because we're digital, we have digital, we have layers. I have the background on its own layer and each character or each subject matter will have its own layer unless it, they need to be like merged together. But usually I'll have, yeah, have it like that's my usual um, layering system. I know. Whenever I'd have like too many layers, I just don't know what layers what. And I just sort of, my eyes just glaze over trying to find what layer I need to be on. Okay. Just lower the opacity on that. A little bit lower. with this sort of color. Yeah, so I kind of just block in... Ah! Ah! Amumu! Thanks for the raid, Amumu! Let's uh, slap, shout out Admumu Sama. <laughs> Thanks for the follow, Kyusu Draws. Let's do a shout out. Splash. Hey, how was your stream? 
Oh my goodness, here are all them splats. Hey everyone, I'm Wiggly Juggins. I am a gelatinous cube, venturing out from the cave to absorb all the art in the world. That is my master plan. Today we are uh, we are painting a uh, a nice little picture here. I'll show you the sketch. Right now we are yes, we're on a hundred. <laughs> Um, yeah, so this is our sketch. We are having this little weird fantasy creature um, staring at this uh, this school student going to school. <clears throat> As a cat over here notices this strange creature. Going, uh, it was good. Made a lot of progress for, for Phoenix Karate. Ah, nice, nice, nice. Using, flexing those VA skills, huh? Yes. Currently, um, we are now in the blocking stage of coloring. So we are just sort of coloring all of this in now. At least blocking in the colors. So basically, um, just getting some colors down. Yes. Thank you again for the raid, Amumu. Okay, so that uh, beam beam the other side shall not be. Uh huh. Why? What happened? Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my goodness me. I thought something serious has ha like had happened. I'm like, oh my god, what happened? Did <laughs> did you get like blinded by something? Okay. Yeah, get some rest. Get some rest. I I it's like it might be like it's like super early or super late for you right now. Down in the caves, it's around about like almost nine. We love you, Mumu. Please get some west. Ooh. If I go RG, if I go RGB mode, will you go rest? It's RGB mode. I need to somehow make this automatic. It's Gamer Slime. All right. All right, gamers. Get your mountain doors ready. We're going. I'll never be a VA. <laughs> as much as I want to, I'll never become one. All right. I'll just continue absorbing the art. Consor I'll just continue consuming art. Yeah. Um, I think I mentioned that uh, from a previous thing. All out for... Mm, uh, I can't do it. All out for... All out. Oh, God, now I'm... Now I'm stage shy. La, 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 la. <clears throat> yes, I can do somewhat of a meat pot impression. It's sort of like you gotta, you gotta somehow like put your tongue in the back of your throat. Wow. All right then, I'm I'm with little Juggins. Here I am. I'm throwing out, and I'm throwing out well. Wow. I think. Uh, oh, I'm gonna color in this hair. God, I'm not even gonna bother. I give up on it. Just sounds cringy to me. 
All right, we'll just go in this here right now. So which Phoenix Wright is this Phoenix Wright? Is it is it like a whole new Phoenix Wright, or is it uh like a like a port? A friend of mine was like super excited about it, but um, all honesty, it sort of went in one ear and out the other. <laughs> Makes you a little bit darker. Bum, 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 bum. Grab my circle brush. But yes, this is how I like to cut, uh, how to, I like to color or paint. I li like to uh, sort of lay down the base or rather lay down sort of a base color, then sort of paint on top of it, the shade shadows and Things. I don't really like using line art. Line art is a pain. Plus, when I do it this way, I can sort of alter things on the fly. With this arm here. This arm's like way too long. Let's just get rid of the shadow. I don't need this here for now. Oh, internet, can you please just not die? That'd be nice. Okay. Let's go here. Okay, shadow, mark this over here. Airbrush. Uh,
Where is my paintbrush? Mm-hmm. Hair pin. Let's give her a pink hair pin. Why not? Or a red one. Red one works. I like red. That needs to be a lot darker. It needs to be a lot more darker. There we go. Quick. And the cat will have it. What a whitish cat. 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 I'm trying to figure out what kind of anime I want to like watch recently. There's like a lot of, like rather movies, sort of anime movies. Like there's not a lot that I've seen other than like Ghibli and um the couple of like a few of the My Heroes. Kind of just like, kind of, kind of feel like just chilling out as I'm in bed. 
watching just anime movies. Oh, one thing I did last, I think, yeah, it was like last night. Um, I found out that they have like a, a like a 24 seven Rick and Morty <laughs> stream on, um, on Adult Swim. And I just ended up through the night, just sort of watching that while I, um, while I read a book. And like eventually, I just I think I just collapsed as I was reading, because like the last thing I remembered, like oh rather the one thing that happened is while I was sleeping, I'm assuming like the episodes that were streaming sort of bled into my dreams a little bit because, from what I recall, the dream was very bizarre, like beyond what I usually would dream. It was very, very bizarre. I chalk it up to it is the uh, half us being asleep listening to the uh, Rick and Morty's episodes. And there's our cat protagonist. Now we'll quickly put in this weird creature. I want the head to be quite vibrant. So we'll start off with like a yellow, a yellow front. Actually, no, not yellow. Blue? No, yeah, we'll go with, We'll go with like a yellow. Also, I need to change this to a flat marker. So I can just try and make some interesting shapes. So I'll just do a duplicate. Teeth. 
Um, yeah, we'll just... What is that, some teeth? Okay, now we got the bug eyes. Okay. Uh, so from yellow, we'll shift down to a red. Oh my goodness me, if this internet, please, would you stop? Hopefully the internet's not going to be too much of a hassle tomorrow when I'm collabing with other people. Where's my mixer brush? I think I'll just do the whole dragon first before I start adding all the details. Right. 
Honestly, I have no idea what this is supposed to be. I have no idea what this creature is supposed to be at all. All right. Can actually change this up a little bit. Why not? We'll change it up. Let's change it up. Hold up. We can change it up. We'll shake it up. All this. We'll have this thing in a different position. Kinda like this sort of position, I reckon. This would be nice. Just because I think it would just being over there is just a little bit boring. Let's, uh, let's make this thing a little bit more interesting. Oh, hacker music. Nice. 
blue eye, make it super bright. Color, increase saturation. Looking good? I hope so. I'm just sort of changing up the designs a little bit. Just wanted a little bit more interesting. This to be a little bit more darker. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yep, needs to be a little bit more white. There we go. Actually, no, we can probably do something. We can probably have some fun with this one. How about instead of white, we shift it more blue. And increase the saturation just a little bit. Let's see how this looks. I think this will be like glowing. I'll have the eye glowing ever so slightly. And then from the blue, we'll use red, the deep red. All right, what if we go over the circle? And then the pupils will have a different color. How's that look from afar? Does it read well? Uh, 
Uh, we can always jump back to it later. As long as we have an idea of the of what this part of the face is. Go with the red. And the pink. Pink, throw in some saturated green. Ah, uh, what else? Red, I guess. No, um, no light like blue. Red. Let's clean up up here a little bit. Oh my goodness, internet, internet issues are, um, are, are um, in issues right now. Okay. I can render on this guy a little bit more. I think I might have to redo the girl actually. Let's do a quick redo of her. I'll hide this layer. Just a quick redo. I'm just not happy with how she's turning out. Oh, that's my thing's loading. Ugh. All right, quick save, do your thing. Saving, 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 saving.
You done, Clip Studio? Okay, cool. I'll just close down these other files. Cool. All right. You turn down more of this. Yeah, I think I'm liking this a lot better. Now if we have light coming down. Let's get my actual brush, my mixing brush. It sounds like it belongs from a video game, whatever this song is. Mixer, no texture. Oh, 
No colors. Oh my goodness, I'm using the wrong brush. No wonder I'm having issues. I will just keep this. I'll just have to do a little bit of extra work to try and get this shape correct. Um. Okay. Honestly, one of the hardest things I have, like one of the hardest things for me at the moment is just trying to uh, paint humanoids efficiently. I feel like whenever I paint a humanoid, it, I have to like, I have to uh, go the long way around. I don't know. I just find them very hard to paint. Give me a creature. Give me a critter. Or rather, give me something weird and I'll be able to paint that. No, like, no sweat. But if you give me a humanoid, uh, I have to like jump through hoops just to uh, just to just to get it done. I'll get there eventually. It's just that I have it just takes me a little bit longer. Yeah, I'm not liking the skirt, how this is coming out. I'll come back to the skirt later. Fix this face. Uh, 
Ah, oh, boy. Internet. Ah. Oh. Oh my goodness me. All right. Rather than having like, rather than having you all have like a really poor experience with this stream, um, I'll have, I'll zoom out just to show what we've got done thus far, because right now the internet is just not cooperating at the moment. But yeah, this is what we have thus far within Oh my goodness, hold out for a little bit longer, please. This is what we've done in about, what does what does my timer say? My Google timer says we've been at this drawing for two hours and 16 minutes. This is what we've got done for two hours and 16 minutes. There was a bit of floundering around, but um, I'm just saved the canvas. But yeah, this is what we managed to get done. Um. Yeah, unfortunately, the internet's not cooperating, and I just, it's, I feel like it's just going to go downhill from now, We've downhill, because I'm seeing the bit rate, and it's just not, it's not looking good. So what we'll do, um, we'll have an, we'll have an end of the early, we'll have an, we'll end the stream early for tonight, um, but we will raid, we will raid someone. I'll have a look who is available. We'll raid a person who's doing art. An art person. So, we will raid. Oh, no, we'll go raid uh, Wiki. Wiki is a very nice individual. They are currently doing uh, puzzles at the moment. We'll go raid Wiki. But yeah, internet is not... Is just not cooperating tonight, unfortunately. So yeah, let me just turn off this music real quick. Yeah. Hopefully the next time um, I stream, the internet will not, or rather tomorrow, because tomorrow is when I start streaming, that um, it will hold. I am praying because it is, we're, we're doing, I'm doing like a collab with a bunch of other VTubers. I hope it holds. But yeah, um, but thank you. Thank you for stopping by and thank you, Amumu Summer, for, um, for raiding me. Uh, let me start up the raid myself as we are going to Wiki. Yeah. All right. So yes, tomorrow we are going to be playing The Forest. I'll we'll, I will be with uh, four other VTubers, or VStreamers, whatever you want to call. Um, yes, it'll be such an experience. It's, it's, uh, it will be like the first time for a majority of them to be playing The Forest. I've only played it a, like a small handful of times. But yeah, anyways. Sorry we had to cut this stream very short. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> thanks. Yeah, I'm, a I'm sorry I had to cut the stream very short. I'm just seeing a trend that my internet connection is just going downhill really quickly. But yes. Um, yeah. Yeah, bye. So um, after the forest stream, I will be doing another art stream if the internet connection is going well. Um, it's just a shame that this is all, it all happened right now. <laughs> Just as I was getting to the groove with the drawing. All right. Anyways, I'll uh, I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye for now. <sighs>